Hello, I'm Susie Jones, the Executive Director of the Art Center of Plano, and I'm here with Carol Graysdorf, our Marketing Strategist, and we just wanted to spend some time and show you the gallery, give you something to hopefully be inspired by, and something to make you happy. This show is an exhibition we did with Plano Art Association, and it is their member show. And then Carol, right behind you, we have a work by Diana Beck. This monochromatic landscape is, is one of her smaller works. It is truly um, dynamic in the lines and the shapes that she creates. Uh, we are actually gonna do a show of hers this fall, something to look forward to. And um, I've been to her studio. Most of her works are much larger, um, brighter colors, and um, but this monochromatic um, field study is really beautiful and really, indicates what her work is like. So we look forward to that show. And then moving into the gallery, and Carol will show you other works that are on display. We're just sorry you all can't come to the gallery and see this, which is why we wanted to show you what we see. This work by Carl Melton, it won honorable mention one of the fan favorites um, of the show. It is an oil colored pencil um, work on, paint, on panel, excuse me. And I think that it is just so relatable to people. We've all um, been out for breakfast. We've all um, had this moment, but the way he captured this gentleman, um, putting ketchup on his eggs, um, the way he shows the color of his skin and the strength of his arms and his face, the plaid, if you've ever tried to draw a person with fabric and folds of all of that, this is just stunning. Um, as well, the very recognizable tablecloth. I think that everyone just can relate to this moment. And uh, the size of it is really impressive as well. I know many of you are homeschooling your children now, something you never maybe thought you would do. This abstract work of art is by Kelly Harad. She is um, a brilliant artist who lives here in Plano. She's a good friend of the Art Center. And so this might be a fun one to share with your children um, and ask them, is this art? Is so this... I would ask that, Susie. Yes. Is this art? Isn't this, isn't this something that I could do, that uh, my child could do. I highly not... encourage you to try. Kelly is very talented um, when it comes to paint and application of paint. Um, she is very spiritual in her um, storytelling, but also the way that she presents her works of art. This piece is no exception. Um, the way that the colors dance with each other, the lines where they're moving up and down, um, I think is really brilliant. I wish you could see the application um, in person. It is highly, highly applied, um, very deep, and um, there's just a lot going on. It's almost like a cloud study that you could go and look and everyone would see something different. So um, we truly, um, this is a favorite of mine, so. As we're walking through the gallery, Susie, tell us a little bit about the Art Center of Plano yes. and this building. This house that we're in um, is the Sailing House. We're located in Haggard Park, as most of you know. We um, have been here in this space about three years after the city of Plano renovated it beautifully back to many of its historic qualities. It was built originally in 1906 as a private home here in Plano. And we're so proud to be here and to be able to display art here. Here's another fun, sort of whimsical uh, work of art. And the artist used a very common object, a bicycle, a tricycle, uh, and, and added uh, his own adornment of uh, plants and greenery and um, even a little whimsy with the, the idea of kind of walking on a tightrope. So, um, this is very different, very fun. Again, does, does this scream art to you? Um, of course it does to the artist because he uh, wants us to see it as a work of art. So he's trying to tell a story and try to get our imagination going with uh, this piece. The title of it is Circus Bonsai because it holds these bonsai plants. So fun. Susie, 
can um, the public rent this facility when <laughs> we are open again? I'm How so does that work? Of course, it's very quiet here today. Carol and I are keeping our six foot distance from one another. But yes, normally you can rent the Art Center for meetings and events and birthday parties. And we encourage you to do so when we're all back out in the public and working together to um, bring this community back to its glory. So um, here, this wall is, is a lot of fun, uh, more abstract works of art. Let's look at this one by Keith Miller. We're gonna have a show this summer, if all things go as planned. Um, this work by uh, Keith is a resin pour that is a very popular medium right now of making art. Um, taking resin and pouring it and then pouring your colors and there's a lot of natural process. Keith is extremely skilled at this and he and his wife, Christine Miller, have a show that's coming this fall called Beneath the Surface, Reimagined and we will have her work. She is a textile artist, and he works, of course, with two-dimensional resin works. So thank you so much. Thank you, Carol. And thank you for joining us on this quick tour of the Art Center. We can't wait to see you again, and everyone stay safe.